I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a Halloween silhouette. I take three fingers in the center and I put a dot. And from that dot going towards the right, I draw a curve line up, curve line down, curve line over, curve line up, curve line down, keep going, and leave it hanging, floating I should say. Now come back to the dot. We're going to draw a curve line up, curve line up, curve line down, curve line down, curve line up, curve line up, one, two, three, curve lines out, curve line in, and leave that floating. Come back over here on the right. And we're just going to draw a curve line, curve line out, curve line one, two, three, curve line in, and leave that floating. Come over here on the right. Right about here, put a dot. We're going to draw a little curve line to the left. Come back to the dot, little curve line to the right. Come back to the left, straight diagonal up, down. Come on the right, straight diagonal up, down. Come back to the left, we're going to draw a curve line in, curve line out, and connect. Come on the right hand side, we're going to draw a curve line out, curve line down, and leave that floating. Come all the way over, jump over. Draw a curve line, curve line, curve line up, connect. If you have room, you can draw another little curve line connect right there on the right. Come up, straight line, curve line, straight line inside on the left, straight line, curve line, straight line inside on the right. Now come back over here. And on the left, we're just going to draw a curve line, curve line down, out, leave it floating. Come on the right, curve line, curve line down, leave that floating. Starting on the left, we're just going to draw slightly wavy line one, slightly wavy line two, slightly wavy line three. If you have a line still floating, go ahead and connect that right there. Come on the inside. Put a dot. We're going to draw a curve line up, down, connect on the left. Put a dot. Curve line up, down, on the right, connect. Right here on the left, straight line. Right here on the right, straight line. Come over here and we're just going to draw a curve line, little curve line, little curve line, little curve line, connect. Now come over here on the left and we're just going to draw a curve line on top, straight line, curve line, connect. Come up to the top and draw this straight line, curve line, connect. Come right about here and go one, two curve lines. Come up on the top, straight line, curve line down, connect, come up to the top again, curve line, connect, little one if you have room, straight line, curve line, connect, come up to the top, curve line, connect. Okay, I think that's all. Let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, a silhouette is when you color everything using a dark color. But I'm going to add purple and just add some little color, a little bit of color on the inside of this space and this space and this space. Okay? 
I'm also going to come down here and I'm going to loop de loop the center straight line or slightly curved line I should say all the way across and I'm going to do that purple also. Then the rest of this is going to be colored black and I'm going to be using the whole part of my fat black crayon. So for the inside part, I'm just going to do up, down, up, down and fill in all these little spaces. Try not to go over your purple because you still want a little bit of that purple to show. But bring it down and around. Now I colored my finished one pretty dark. This one I'm going to do a little bit lighter just because of time. But if your hand starts hurting, like I always tell you, stop, give your hand a rest, and then come back and finish your drawing. So we're just going to color this all black. And you can make a silhouette of anything. I thought it might be fun to do one for Halloween. And I also picked a spooky tree because I didn't want to do a lantern or witches or ghosts bats. This is pretty interesting. Then come over here and with your black crayon, try and stay away from your eyeballs, but you want to color this space all dark black. Bring it down and don't forget your tail. Okay. Now you come over to your graveyard, same thing. You want to color your gravestones, these spaces, all black. The silhouette means that you don't really have too much detail that you leave open for color. Pretty much, pretty easy to color because it's all black. Of course, you're going to mess up your hands. I had to wash mine. Okay, now I come down to these spaces and I'm going to go ahead and loop de loop going across my stripes, top and bottom. Okay, and again, you'll color this in better than me. And then I take the side of my crayon and I color in, try not to hit your eyeballs. And I color in the background with a light black. So basically, everything is gradations of black. Okay? And as always, like I said, you guys will do a better job coloring than I am. Okay, let's see what this looks like all colored in. Okay, here is my Halloween silhouette haunted tree, black cat, graveyard, picture, all colored in. Okay, bye-bye.